So this is a remote screen, but it can actually be remote anywhere in the world. So it has a WAN IP, which is wide area network, versus a LAN, which is local area network, which we're using right now, which is a 192.168.0, blah, 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 or 192.168.1. However, this is the dyno screen, so no need to go run by and get swept under the dyno when you can do this. But the coolest part is your tuner can watch the entire run from anywhere in the world. So you're not just sending logs anymore, they're actually able to watch the run.
What's up guys, Mike with Speed Society here. We're here with the all new Whole Shot software. To start off, it's way more user friendly. We can do a lot more with it, a lot more features. You can log in as a customer and watch your car do a dyno pull and see all your pulls remotely. It's really cool that Mustang can log in remotely and update the system as we get new cars and new projects in that we might not have in the computer yet. So it's really cool. The system's always updating, always improving, and always new features are being added. All right, so you can see right off the bat that the whole screen is different. It's a whole new system. Uh, you log in, and then here's our home screen. We have all kinds of different features. We can turn on our webcam so our customers will be able to watch. And then we have all of our different settings. So if you want to set up the dyno, you can load a vehicle. We already have it set up for the GTR being on here. You can go in and see all the vehicle history, all of the different pulls we've done with it. Um, you can go in to your dyno setup. You have a cool screen so you can set all the different functions. You can unlock it, lock it, all wheel drive, rear wheel drive, whatever you need to do. Then you can come back and you have all these awesome test screens. So we'll go down the power curve. Once you have your car loaded up and in the computer, you can go over here to dyno setup. You see you have everything. Say the GTR is all wheel, so we're gonna go over here, set the mode, and then we're gonna unlock the rollers. After the dyno is set up, we're able to go down here to power curve, and as you can see, we have all new screens set up. You can see the webcam, you have your power, your horsepower, your torque. It's really cool, really a pretty cool setup. As you can see, after your pull is completed, you'll be able to go in and you have this first initial screen with all your key stats, and then you can go here and you can do a single graph, a double graph, and then you can also overlay it with previous runs. But here you can see the different runs and you can see the variance and you can you can customize all this to your individual needs and uses, which is really cool. So you have just a wide variety of different screens and setups you can make to tailor to your dyno use. To touch on a couple other cool features the whole shot software has, we can customize our, our screens to whatever we want. So we can drag in here, we can set this up. So we have this like this, and then we can come over here and insert our live feed. So if we wanna set this up for the lobby or the waiting room while customers are watching their cars get tuned. We have that there. We can throw in you know, our mile per hour right here. Shrink that up a little bit. Then we can throw in our, we can throw in whatever channel we want. So we can go here, put this in and say we want to add it to RPM. So we'll drag it to fit. We'll go here and we say we want our RPM and we can select whatever color we want. So if we want it green, there you go. And then we can add just all kinds of different graphs as we want and set the graphs to read however we want them to. So if we want this to be, say, horsepower, you can add that, you can set the max and the minimum, and we have a full test screen here, ready to go. In addition to all that, we can also do full eighth mile, quarter mile sprints on the dyno, and we have a drag tree, so you get your reaction time, your real quarter mile time, so it's as close to being at the track on the dyno. That was a quick rundown of the all new whole shot software. We love it here at Speed Society and we can't wait to hear what you guys think.